Welcome into the Dog Zone. Doggies to follow for this week. Firstly, we'll go back to last week and have a little look at the wash up. Here it is. Retired Mouse into third. Opawa Light second. Beaten by the sausage, which was painful. Mitchum Quinn and a big time mini both getting the job done. And Rosso, you went two from three. Uh, we both went big time mini. How good is she, Andy, uh, to carry us both to victory? Uh, and Philippa, you have generally been pretty good as well, so adding you into the mix to put the heater on us this week. Do my best, I do my best anyway, that's all I can do. <laughs> <laughs> right, uh, this week, hmm, I've gone for a Quinella that Andy says is going to pay $1.40. Well, take it. Uh, Kiakatu <laughs> Fever and Joe Brat over a distance. They look absolute standouts. I can't pick the winner, so I'll take them both first and second. Each way in race 10 is a nice field, that, but I do like fired up Jasper from box two, backable each way in that field, and Chalet Palais at Monaco on Sunday in a class four field. Now, Chalet Palais ran second in the Auckland Cup last year. It's actually quite a nice class four field, but Chalet Palais went all right last week. So, Philippa, embarrass us this week. Well, I've gone for Marshall, who's back on his home track, Platinum Marshall, box number one as well, so I think he's well boxed there. The downgrader Smash Wild into box number four in the last for Malcolm Grant. Each way there at Hattrick Raceway, idle hot for Marcy Flip in the last, I think he strikes a field he can win. And the Redeemer, Diana Dave, well, he's pretty much in the cup constellation. He was the favourite going into it for the futures, and I'm hoping for once, Diana Dave, you can redeem yourself out there in box number eight. All of mine go around on Thursday. We'll try and build a little bit of a kitty for Sunday afternoon. Race number nine kicks away the... Uh, sorry, race number two, meeting nine on Thursday at Addington, kicks away the We Appear. Dizzy Banjo off box number one, race five. Sunday Johnny off box one. He's been costly to me in recent weeks, but surely he gets the job done come Thursday. Each way, Thursday at Cambridge is Fancy Fox. That's how we see the week ahead in the Greyhound world. Until next time, happy punting. For you to say something, though.